In Crime Tracker 10 tonight, the Delaware County prosecutor calls this man a menace to society. And tonight, he's behind bars. Joshua Johnson has been indicted on 98 counts, accused of stealing credit cards from gym lockers and going on a shopping spree. The gyms are all across central Ohio, from Westerville to Grove City, Hilliard to Pickerington. 10 TV's Danielle Elias spoke with a victim who was hit hard. She joins us live in Powell with more on that. Danielle. Well, Jerry, in my hand here, I have the indictment, the charges, in fact, for that's for this man who's accused of committing all these crimes all over central Ohio, Franklin County, Delaware County, right here at this gym. These victims, we spoke with them, and they say what started off as a routine trip to the gym turned out to be anything but. Oh, I was furious, okay? I, I work three jobs, okay? I bust my butt. I'm a lot of things to a lot of people, but I don't consider myself a victim. This time, Paul Gibney was. Went to go get changed, get my stuff. Everything looked normal. Uh, you know, my, my lock was still locked, and uh, I thought everything was fine. But I couldn't find my keys. Gibney says his car was still there, but the doors were open. And inside, he found something strange. There were my keys sitting on the floor mat in the center. And I knew at that point, things were really wrong. He says his wallet was gone. That's when he says he realized someone broke into his locker without leaving a trace. Yes, this was my lock. This was the lock that he had gotten into. Police say it's as easy as using scissors and a soda can to be able to open a lock like this. That's why they encourage you to use a more sturdy lock, like a disc lock, to protect your valuables. Unfortunately, Gibney isn't the only victim at the gym. Investigators say this man, 31-year-old Joshua Johnson, stole wallets, credit cards, and cash from nearly two dozen people across Franklin and Delaware counties. He, he's pretty, pretty widespread equal opportunity uh, thief. Now Johnson is behind bars, and people like Gibney say they've learned their lesson the hard way. I keep my wallet and I keep my cell phone with me at all times, regardless of what I'm doing. I just don't, you know, I, I can't afford this to ever happen again. But get this, Johnson was actually picked up in California while committing the same crimes, I'm told. And that's when he was brought back to Delaware County for an outstanding warrant and now faces a whole new slew of charges. He's expected to be arraigned next week. Reporting live in Delaware County, Danielle Elias, 10 TV News. Before we let you go, Danielle, for a guy who seems to have done this type of crime regularly, he was only wanted for crimes in two counties? Well, Jerry, in fact, I've learned from police and from the prosecutor that there are many more associated with this man. I'm told that he has a history of these types of crimes. And now I've been told there are outstanding warrants for similar thefts for this man in five different counties, including Butler, Licking, Montgomery, Greene, and even Boone County in Kentucky. Of course, we'll keep track of him, bring you more. Back to you.